this. Like, hello, Edges, welcome to Snatchville. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bounce, bounce full, I put the city on East Street, East Street, East Street, East Street. Hey guys, welcome Ooh, why am I yelling? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kai Rashawn. Welcome back to another edition of Wiggy Wednesday. Yes, I'm so excited about today because I am reviewing a unit that was sent to me by Ebony Line. But before we get into all the specs of this unit and what I think about it, shout out the pack. Make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so like I said, this unit was sent to me by Ebony Line. It is from Sensationnel. It is the Empress Lace Lace Front Edge unit by the name of Alani. I got her in the color 1B and she does retail for $35.95 so well within that medium price point for synthetic wigs this unit does come with about a five inch lace part like you see right here in the middle as well as a lace from edge to crown so that is lace all the way from the ear to the center of the unit um, the unit also comes with a pre-plucked type of hairline it also comes with two combs in the front one comb in the back and the adjustable straps now the size of this cap can be small depending on how you manipulate the cap or put it on your head or how your hair is styled under this unit Unit. I will say how it's fitting on my head right now. It's perfect. However, my girl Brittany aka the hearts and cakes 90 did review this unit a couple weeks ago um, And she actually was saying that the cap was too small However, she had tried it on I think a second time and she said it fit a little bit better It does fit snug I will say that for my 23 inch head But it is down onto my hairline on both sides as you can see right here It comes down perfectly on the back of my head and it fits snug right here in the front So I will say this is like a perfect fitting cap for for my big hair girls, but only if you have your hair flattened under this cap. If you have your hair just out like I normally do in my little bush or whatever, it probably would have fit a little bit snug or maybe too small. But I do have my hair corn rolled under my wig cap right now, so that's why my head is basically fitting at 23 inches even. So if your head is bigger than that, then... But as far as I'm looking right now, you may want to go ahead and get it anyway because she a banger. This unit is a premium fiber unit, so it is heat safe up to about 400 degrees. However, they already come in these really cute corkscrew curls, which I think are just bomb. Um, I didn't go in with my wide tooth comb or my paddle brush. You guys know I am heavy handed with the paddle brush, okay? But I let her sit today, I let her rest today, and I just went in and kind of finger combed or finger pulled or tugged through the curls a little bit to kind of loosen them up just a tad bit. Now I am getting some shedding with this unit, like actual pieces. I don't, I don't know what that's about. I don't know if that's from me cutting the lace off or just some residual extraness going on. Um, but yeah, let's let's not have too many of those come out. I don't want to start getting bald spots, okay? Let, let's keep the momentum going, sensational. Don't disappoint me. But this is how she is looking from the side and then from the back. You obviously can see my wig cap in there. This unit does fall about, I would say about 20, the longest piece is about 22 inches, and then if I turn around, as far as falling on my back, it comes down about like mid back for me you can see right there this unit does give off a natural density which i love um it's not too full it's not too thick but if the unit does get too hot you can style this in up styles so as you can see here it has like a little teensy bit of like baby hairs coming down so you can definitely do like a little up style situation with it to you know protect your neck you know because you know it's still hot out here this is a stationary part so this is how the unit comes in this parting area however it does have the lace here in the front which is already like the hairline looks very natural do y'all see that hairline like i did not pluck that that is how that hairline came cindy lou get your butt back over i did not touch this hairline not one bit y'all know i've been tweezer happy lately but this is how she's sitting like hello Edges, welcome to Snatchville. Oh, you. <laughs> Now this unit does come with baby hairs, but you do not have to use the baby hairs if you don't want to. I did use them for this look because I just felt like doing baby hairs today. And y'all know I'm not that great with them, so don't be in my comments telling me my baby hairs look like trash. You know, I tried, I tried. That's what counts, as long as you try. 
This is definitely a winner winner chicken dinner in my opinion. She's definitely gonna be an everyday wig for me because she's a very easy plop and go unit. Like I said, I didn't pluck no hairline, I didn't tweeze no part. I did go in with powder in my parting space and across the lace here in the front a little bit to kind of blend it down. That is it. And she was ready to go. Now I will tell you guys about this lace. She is an Empress lace wig, which you guys have seen that I reviewed on my channel. Um, I reviewed the Alana wig on my channel last week and she came with that hard edge scratching lace like mm, ooh, nightmares this one is from the same line however the lace is a little bit better so still wear your wig grip okay it's this is still wig grip 101 okay you know save your edges but she shouldn't be snatching nothing out okay she not grinding across my edges i don't hear the scratchiness like she's not that type of lace but she's not as soft as she could be is what i'm saying i think this is a slay y'all let's just take a moment to appreciate the sledge. Um, your enemy could never. <laughs> could never, okay? Could never. Bring your edges in your wig grip, okay? Just come on down. I'm gonna go ahead and pass the collection plate, okay? Give me your likes, okay? Give me your likes, cause you can't hate on this wig. If you hate on this wig, then something is and that's all, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna leave it at the pause. Fill in the blanks. This is an effortless, effortless wig. It gives me that wet and wavy look without all the product in my hair that's gonna damage my clothes. Look at that. <laughs> Business casual. <laughs> yes. Okay. Again, baby hairs. It looked like I spent some coin and I only spent $30. Get your change purse. This wig right here, it's a look. Okay, it's a look and I like it. I like it a lot. You could never bundle Brenda. You could never. Y'all know when I got the girls out, I must be feeling something special. <laughs> like this whole boop, all of it. <laughs> Kenny, Kenny, I'll see you when you get home. Do y'all see what I'm seeing? Do you see what I'm seeing? Huh? Do you? Do you, Linda? I'm, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. And guess what? You should be too. All right. That's all, I, that's all I got. That's all I got. I will put the direct link for this unit down below. So whoever wants to check it out, you can. But shout out to Ebony Line one more time for sending me this unit. I really appreciate you guys. They also sent me like a whole bunch of goodies, y'all. Pack lashes y'all saw me do the other day. That was from them. They also sent me like some free spray. They also sent me like a whole gang of like wig caps. Like, okay, I really appreciate that. Hello? Okay, I appreciate the wig caps. But make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Don't forget to smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.